YouTube, what's going on, you guys? I know it's been a while, and I apologize, you guys. I've been so busy. Uh, I've had a new job, and I kind of went downhill for just a little bit, but I'm back on my feet. I'm back again. I still have the 125 and the 250. Uh, as you can see, I'm cleaning it up right now. And look at this, it's all dirty. I haven't rode in a while, you guys. Uh, it's been a minute. Uh, it's been a minute. Uh, the weather here has been crazy. It's been raining a lot and stuff. But I haven't been riding. But I cleaned it. They were all dusty and stuff like that. Uh, I cleaned it. But I'm going to start riding back. But I still haven't gotten my actual uh, my actual plate for both of my bikes. Uh, like I said, I've been having some money issues. I gotta take care of that you guys like i said i'm gonna go and do it i'm gonna vlog it how to do it so if you uh if you got one of these clones you know you got the certificate or whatnot i will guide you through it so stay tuned for that i'm gonna do it pretty soon i'm gonna go get inspected you know and register it and all that and i'm gonna take y'all with me uh, but like i said thank you for the support you know comment like and share i see some of y'all commenting and i appreciate that uh but lately, there's been so many questions that I can't even keep up. But I appreciate y'all for the support. Uh, I'm still going to continue riding. You know, I love motorcycles. This is for life. You know, I would have had already a new bike. But I ended up buying this right here. This is the cost, you guys. It's a Volkswagen GTI boosted. Uh, man, I just fell in love with the car, you know. It's uh, five speed. I'll let y'all check it out real quick. You know, this is why I haven't gotten a new bike yet because I recently just bought this car. You know, it has boost and everything. It's a fun little car, you know. Uh, I never knew how to drive uh, stick shift. So that's why I bought it too because it was a small little car. It's a 1.8 turbo and it was stick shift, you know. And I'm like, man, you know, you just gotta, you just gotta, you know, like just enjoy life. You know what I mean? So I'm like, man, you know, I need to learn how to, I need to learn how to drive stick shift. So that's why I bought it too. Uh, you know, it's, it's no different. It's no different in the bike. It's the exact same thing, just on the bike. You know, you have to use this for the clutch. And, you know, you got the shifter down there. And uh, it, it's, it's similar, you guys. It's really, really similar. It's easy. Uh, no, one, no one taught me. Uh, I taught myself just watching YouTube videos, just like this one. When I first got into bikes, I started with the 50cc. You know, it was automatic, of course. It didn't have no clutch, no shifter or nothing. So, you know, after that, I wanted to learn, you know, a real motorcycle. So I ended up getting this, you know, like not even a year later, guys. Like maybe 10 months later, I ended up getting this. But this one, this one wasn't really, uh, the, the people who had it didn't take care of it. It did not look like this. It did not look like this at all. I put a little, this right here, this will change you guys. I recommend y'all, this is live right here. I recommend y'all getting this. Oh, it's a little dirty right here. Hold on. It's a little dirty right here. But this, this, this LED bar right here, this, this changed the whole look. It looks mean like that, you know. But it was not like this. It was not like this. I did a, uh, a fender delete. I put a new carburetor. You know, uh, the only thing that came with this exhaust, you guys, a zoom. This is a really, really good exhaust. So if you have a 125cc, I recommend you getting this, you guys. I recommend this. And check this out, before I changed the carburetor, it would shoot flames. Like, man, that was pretty cool. And it was on a stock carburetor. But uh, I ended up getting this one. It's like a cheap little uh, carburetor from eBay. And I haven't had no issues with it. Actually, here's a little choke right here. Uh, here's a pot filter. I haven't had no issues. But uh, like I said, you know, this one, the person who had it didn't take care of it. Uh, the LED, the speedometer, it didn't have, well, it had it, but it, it got rained on. So, uh, so it, it didn't work, you know. I couldn't see the shifters. And I ended up buying a new one, but I couldn't figure out how to wire it. So I learned this just watching YouTube videos without without the shift, uh, or speedometer or whatever. And I learned really quick, you guys. It was really, really easy. And one thing about this bike, these Venoms, I don't know if y'all have a Venom or not, the shifter's kind of hard, so it's kind of tricky to shift. Like this one is really smooth and really sensitive, but this one's super hard. 
and man you gotta just time it right to shift it's kind of weird but I, I ended up getting it you know within a couple days or whatnot just like the car same thing just a couple watching youtube videos a couple days you know and it was easy uh, and it's fun you guys so i recommend y'all if y'all have a automatic y'all want to go stick shift go stick shift it saves you gas and it's a lot a lot of fun just like the bikes you guys okay so i just want to give y'all a quick update of what's going on i'm still here in the channel i'm gonna continue doing more videos uh my friend's 50 cc broke down again so i don't know we're going to fix it or what he's going to do with it but uh i'm gonna vlog tomorrow i'm gonna see if we can try to fix it or whatnot but i will will be getting a new bike in a couple months i want a 250 a honda rebel or a honda shadow i want to change it up a little bit you know what i mean that's going to be my next bike here in the future so y'all stay tuned like i said thanks for the support you know just give you a little quick update of what's going on i'm cleaning the bikes right now they're looking good well yeah guys uh y'all just stay tuned Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Like, share, and subscribe. Peace out.